Our base is freaking loaded, bro. For Ian Hat. Come on. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to the video. Welcome back. Today is Saturday, April 8th. If you guys watched the most previous video, then you probably know what today is for me. We're going up to Chicago for a Cubs game, so I'm super, super excited. This is my first Cubs game at Wrigley in April. All the other times I've gone has been in September, so I'm excited for an April day game. The game's at 3.05. Guys, it is 6.30 in the morning right now. It's just starting to get light outside. So I basically got up an hour ago. I've been working on getting ready, getting dressed. I'm not in any Cubs attire right now, but it's going to be cold up there in Chicago. So I have my sweatshirt on, but when we get up to the game, I have my jersey neatly tucked up in this bag. And then I have my Cubs hat, so those two things will help uh, get me in all my Cubs attire. You can barely tell because... I, I do have cub socks on. It's the jersey and then the away jersey, basically. So home jersey, away jersey <laughs> um, on both feet. So I do have those. The main reason why we are going up so early, it's six, it's almost 6.30. I'm going with my Aunt Lauren and Uncle Alex. Um, They're also Cubs fans. We planned this a week ago. If you didn't watch the most previous video, then you don't know how this came about. But basically, opening day last week, I was like, dude, I really want to go to a game so soon. And I was eyeing this one for today. Long story short, I mentioned the idea to them and they were both so down. We bought the tickets that day and we've been planning. We've had this plan for just about a week. The reason why we are going so early today, although the game doesn't even start till 3.05, we are leaving at 6.30 because we want to get up there, have plenty of time to park, take pictures, walk around. Like, we just want to enjoy and have a nice day. This is probably, I think this is my fourth Cubs vlog. Um, and my goal every year is just to make them more fun, more entertaining, and yeah, and just more memorable. So here we go. It's first the Rangers today. Um, I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. So I'm going to stop rambling on, but I really hope you guys come along. I'm about to leave, so I just turned off all my living room lights, so I had to be at the door. But also, this is the first time in two years where I'm not going with my mom where I've had to make her go with me because <laughs> she doesn't really care. So it's nice to actually go with some, uh, you could say Cubs fans that are like super, super excited. And it officially begins because we're on the main road. Let's go. Or the one that she sees later. Then you got it, we'll speak later. Rod, 
waves don't be a while till we wave. <laughs> there we go. That was better. I had to just look at the lyrics. <laughs> And so, yeah, it's literally Easter weekend, and everyone, those people don't, but literally the Easter ears, that's crazy. I wonder where they get them from. And why is everyone walk? Is it, I wonder where these people are from. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, the game don't even start five hours. I love it. This is um actually no right down to the right is where the Cubs players go into there to the clubhouse area. Wow. So th these are the bleachers. Oh, that's a stop sign. These are the bleachers. We're parking right next to this Wrigleyville dog. Not too far from the field. L little tiny walk. Final fit. <laughs> Fit, fit check. <laughs> yeah. So, is that Thompson, I think, and Stu? This really is my first time in Gallagher Way, though. Although, I've been here. Ooh, I've not seen these statues, though. Very pretty cool. There's Ron Santo. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah. There's a Cubs store. We can go in here. Pragmatic. Mm, Ryan Sandberg. All the jerseys. Honestly, the next jersey I'll probably buy will be a City Connect Nico Horner, honestly. Or if they extend Ian Happ. <laughs> Look at this world champion. These bats. Okay, so this is the first time, but we we are standing over where players come out. I see, I see P Wizzy, bro. That's Patrick Wisdom. Marcus Stroman. <laughs> I did get one signature, Miles Master Booney. Or Boney. <laughs> so how are you? Well, we're taking this back to the car, but Miles Masturboni and Eric Hosmer. 
pretty good. Two signs, not bad. Okay. Little Red Bull car. Jake Arrieta's Cy Young, yeah. I wonder what that one is. That's just a base. Hollywood bases. Got our food. This is Brick House Town. Swanson's sign. Oh, because we're, we're right behind you. Yeah, this is where we'll go. There's Ian Hap. Everybody in. Welcome to Wrigley and have a great time. Thank you. So we just got on the concourse. We got these 10,000, first 10,000 people get these hats. So we all got them. This is our section right here, 220 row one. We're probably like right towards the end. So we're like right over there, this first row. But they're doing batting practice. Can I see anyone? Who's that? I see Miles Master Booney. I think that's Patrick Wisdom. Where's Dansby? Where's my boy? There he is. So this is the furthest that I've gone into the outfield. Okay, we're standing here, a ball right in this corner. Patrick Wisdom throws it up to me. I just can't, dude. Patrick Wisdom, too. Keegan Thompson. For sure, that's Keegan Thompson. <laughs> We're in line to see the World Series trophy in here. We got our picture taken, but there it is. Going up the bleachers for the first time. We're rising. Oh, yeah. Juniors. Looking at the Cubs Hall of Fame. Ooh, Ernie Banks. 17. Mark Grace autograph. A lot of definitely old time. Ooh, Ryan Sandberg Silver Slugger, you said? This one. Ben Zobris helmet from the World Series. World Series base. Postseason base. Base. Ian Hap's gold glove. Greg Maddox. Lee Smith. Ryan Samberg. Berkey. Billy Williams. Ooh, Hap Wilson. All right, we got 20 minutes till game starts. We're getting the field ready. And then we got first pitch down there. I still, I still got my ball. Number two, Nico. 
Put in Keegan Thompson. Right. One and two. Come on, 
happy. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go! Oh, I don't know. I did not know where that went. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Woo! There it is! There it is! Alex, he called it! He called it! Jan Gomes is doing her home run, bro. Wow. Woo! Nico Horner with a single, so we got first and second. Dansby again and again. Hell yeah. That's my boy. That's my fucking boy. <laughs> so much swag. Base is freaking loaded, bro. For Ian Hat. Come on. It's tank too. Look at all the seagulls out there. They are crazy. Strike out on seagull. All right. Down to the last out. Oh, it's a pump. Some guy just walked by and said he likes my hat. <laughs> Oh wow! 
left raising canes. None of us have had raising canes. And they had one right there. So we got some. We're heading back to the car. Right there. So and it's like game. and it's like a perfect game to end with raising canes. First time. Oh, can I go that way? Excuse me. <laughs> this is gonna be good. I really wish I knew who hit this ball to the outfield during BP. And then P. Wizzy, Patrick Wisdom, threw to me. Dang, baby, look at this. Damn, bro, you, we got the green, bro. What the fuck you what doing? What the hell? The hell? I'm fucking standing there at a red light for 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I love how, like, I mean, we were kind of doing it, but people just go wherever. This is the place I want to go next. Right outside the front. Hey, Chick fil A. But yeah, look, everyone's out because it's a Saturday evening. Well, they act like you do. Literally, after a Saturday evening Cubs win, everyone's out. Not that way, bro. I got more pedestrians. Yeah, I'm not gonna hit oh, yeah, you. Oh, yeah, we're gonna stop. Yeah, oh, yeah, I'm gonna hit you. Keep going. Yeah, I'm gonna hit you. Right in the face. <laughs> Go ahead. Stop. Road work again. I sure hope it does. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even tried my chicken yet. <laughs> I'm not even trying to say nothing, but I'm just saying. <laughs> this chicken. Solid 9.7 out of 10. Like. It runs up with Zach's knees, so I'm just saying. Oh man, <laughs> we stopped at this gas station and I smelt these as soon as we went in and uh, got some frosting to go with. Oh my god guys okay i am back home i want to show you guys what i got after the game so we went shopping in the sports world chicago right across from uh, wrigley field i didn't get anything the first time before the game but after the game i knew what i wanted and we went back and i bought it it's funny because i've actually been telling myself i want a black cub shirt for so long because black goes with everything and i just i wanted a black cub shirt all i got is like gray or blue of course so I got a black cub shirt, okay? It's got all this stuff on the back. So I thought this was pretty cool. Um, I had to get this. Nice, I like it, so I got this. I really wanted to get the, kind of like a forest green, like ivy. It's like the color of the cub scoreboard and it had the clock on it and it said 120. And I wanted to get that, but they were very overpriced at the, on the, sidewalk location so i'm like okay i'm just gonna order it online all right guys i don't even know where to end i don't want to ramble on too much i'm sure this video is already full of a lot but we just got home and may i just say this was probably just this is definitely going to be on my list of top best days top most fun experiences um this is my fourth time at wrigley and this every year i do something new and different like this year i got a freaking ball okay I got signatures. We explored even more than I have before. So when we got there, we got there super mad early today. We wanted to have all these opportunities to do new things early. So we get to where the players are arriving. Okay, you guys saw? 
And uh, we were a little late to that, actually, because we ended up walking around a little bit. And then when we finally got back to that area, we saw Patrick Wisdom, Ian Happ, Miles Masterboni, and Eric Hosmer. And um, I did see Marcus Stroman, but he was way on the other side. But so he didn't come through the main area to get signatures. He probably was avoiding everybody. Anyways, we didn't have anything for any of the players to sign nothing. So Alex offered to go across the street back into the store we were in. And he got me the scorecard and a Cub Sharpie, um, which was just awesome. Because then I was able to get Miles Master Boney's signature in the black. And then Eric Hosmer in the blue. You guys saw them do it, right? So... Super, super exciting memory. And then the ball is actually out there in my book bag. But we get inside, we go over to the right field foul line, and Patrick Wisdom, and like, look, you guys saw this, but I'm just talking out loud. Patrick Wisdom was out there, because he played right today. He was out there fielding um, batting practice balls, and it came over, touched the ivy, like, as a grounder. And I was like, Wisdom, because I didn't get this on video. It was so spur of the moment. But this is what I said. I said, wisdom, just hoping he would he would toss it up. And he looked at me, underhanded it, and I had to reach my arms over the pole, and I just so gracefully caught it in my palms. I was so, I, I thought I was going to drop it. I mean, anyways, I got a ball. I got autographs. It was just an insane day. And I'm just so thankful, blessed, everything that it happened the way it did and yeah so I really appreciate you guys coming along and if you're a Cubs fan I hope that this was just really enjoyable for you guys we're definitely gonna go back at least a few more times this year hopefully at least just once or twice uh, this is my first April game my first spring game and it was great just a great Cubs win I have had the curse of all the other Cubs games I've been to the most they've the Cubs have scored has been two um, and all of those runs in each of the last two games I was at, I've magically been on the concourse getting a f like food or a snack or going to the bathroom and we'll just start hearing the home run music and we'll go up and we're like, damn, we missed it. So today I've seen, I saw every single run scored by the Cubs. Um, and it was, it was just fantastic. It was like great. And I was very lucky about pressing record before every big play. Thank God. This video, as of right now, it's of course Saturday night. I plan to get this video up Monday. Um, it's not going to be up on Sunday because tomorrow's Easter. We're going to be doing stuff. I'm not going to be able to get every single clip done. And I want to put a lot of time into this video. So I'm going to aim for Monday, latest Tuesday. But I really want to get it up as soon as possible. So anyways, I really, really appreciate you guys watching this video. Seriously, this, this means so much to me. Um, and I hope that you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please make sure to like and subscribe. Cheers if you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one.